Eight hours is a long cycle time. But that's in some ways a good thing, because that gives us room to play with. And one of the biggest mistakes I see grinders make is they choose some grinding parameters, they dress the wheel, and they remove all their material in those eight hours. But you've got eight hours to play with, so why not mix it up a little bit? And here's one of the things you can do to drastically reduce your cycle time by mixing up your parameters. What you want to do is dress your wheel like hell. <sighs> Rip off all that material with a deep cut, a fast diamond speed. Your wheel's going to be very open and very sharp. Then you're going to grind away your material. You're going to grind away 99% of that material with that open wheel. That open wheel is going to generate very little heat because it's so sharp. And it's going to give you a really rough surface finish. But that's okay. We're going to remove almost all the stock and leave maybe 50 microns or 2,000 material. Then we're going to go back and we're going to dress the wheel again. This time we're going to dress it with a really slow diamond traverse and maybe a shallow dressing depth, maybe 10 microns or 4 tenths. Then we're going to go back and we're going to do our finish grind. And we're going to remove that last thou or 25 microns of material. And we're going to do it with very fast, small depths of cut. So maybe we'll take 5 microns or 2 tenths every pass. We're going to go very fast because that's good for reducing the risk of grinding burn. And even though our wheel is now very dull because we dressed it dull, that's okay because we're moving only a little bit of material. We can have a really low material removal rate. And we can get that really good surface finish with no burn. I was at a company last year and they had a 13 hour cycle time. And I used this technique. I said, hey, dress like hell, grind like hell, dress timidly, grind timidly. They did that and they got their cycle time down from 13 hours to an hour and a half. And they didn't have any increased risk of burn. So this is a very simple technique and it just makes sense that if you want to remove most of your stock, remove it with a sharp wheel and then save just a little bit, dress your wheel dull, finish it off with that good surface finish. Boom, you've got a good surface finish, no burn, and a really short cycle time.